Whoa! Have we got a show for you? Halle Berry is eternally miffed that she's still the only black woman to win the Best Actress Oscar. And she's saddened by it year after year. Notice one little thing right here. Black woman. I mean, come on, Hallie. Just, just give it up already when everything is about race and gender. We don't even know what a woman is anymore, according to Hollywood. So you can't even put woman in there. That yes, you won it for Monsters Ball in 2002 with only one other woman of color. Michelle Yeoh, for everything, everywhere, all at once, won it then, too. And she just doesn't understand why she thought she opened a door for people of color. Not only people of color, women of color. You do this to yourselves. I'm not even going to read out this name because I'll be called racist, even though I am a person of color. Red is a color. White is actually all the colors. And black is the absence of all the colors. But so, you know, that's talking about light, yes. But anyway, you know, everything can be transformed into what fits your narrative. This is some of the dumbest crap that I've seen in a long time. And we see this kind of crap every day. But it's kind of like standing out to me. Allie Berry. You have not been in the public eye for quite a long time. Don't know what you've been doing. Hope you've been happy. But uh, you kind of need to get with the program and get on the, the side. You, you're obviously taking a side that you have been, uh, you know, taking a little sabbatical from from a little bit. I thought there were women that rightfully, arguably could have, should have, could have, should have, would have. Not saying there haven't been great black actresses. Great black actresses in great movies. You have to look against the competition for that year. I mean, come on. When we have something like Parasite, which is an absolutely fucking fantastic movie, winning best film, it's a foreign film. Have you ever come to realize that um, the U.S. is just not putting out that many great films anymore? We're going to foreign film to find things that actually have artistic value and talent in them. Uh, one of her biggest heartbreaks, as it never opened a door for more black women at the house. It never opened, but the door was always open. Maybe not for women. Oh, wait, did you think about Oprah and uh, the color purple? She was known for that role. Come on, this is before she started giving away cards to everyone. Shut your mouth when it comes to that. Well, I was chosen to open a door, just like Jennifer Lawrence was chosen to be the first female action hero. Sure, I believe that. Was that an important moment? Or was it just an important moment for me? I mean, it was good for you. you I think you deserve it. Monsters Ball was a very good movie. I really liked it. That was when you were on top of your game. You had Swordfish uh, the year directly after that. I, no one's trying to take anything away from you. But this is the entire problem with Hollywood these days now, Hallie. It's you are only looking at immutable characteristics in order to gauge their worth and value it's not did this person do a bang up job was this a wonderful story very well acted beautifully shot well written you're not looking at that you're looking at oh did the person that gave this performance did they fit the right melanin color did they have the right chromosomes which like I said earlier, y'all can't even nail that down because now men can be women. XYs can be XXs. So you might want to come to a conclusion on that before you start having a little pity party because you fell out of the limelight for a while. How was that Catwoman movie? Did you think that one was going to win you an Oscar? 
Speaking at Can Lion the year after Oscar So White went viral, it went, oh my gosh. Her Oscar win really meant nothing. It meant nothing. I thought it meant something, but I think it meant nothing. Go boohoo in the corner more. Are you fucking serious? Listen here. You little coddled piece of ass. Because that's all you are. I'm not even going to say the word that I want to say. It starts with an M, and I guess I'll just leave it there. It starts with an M, and it goes back a little bit. You are not even fully black. No one, there are very few people who are fully one race anymore. We are all a melting pot, a mixing pot. That's the great thing about America is that we all got together. We all became family. Racial lines got mixed and we grew together. And you, as one of these people, just talking about only the color of your skin. That's the only thing you seem to identify by. It's fucking disgraceful. I'm not sorry about anything that I've said here. And... Hallie, I mean, grow a fucking pair. Because you could still be a woman and have a pair of balls nowadays. This is Malty from the GCA. Y'all take care. Much love. And stop being a little bitch.